Blue Jays man. I got a Blue Jay! I got a Blue Jay! He didn't hear me. He gonna hear me. He gonna hear me. <laughs> he gonna hear me. Watch this. He gonna hear me. Sir! Sir, I got a Blue Jay! Got a Blue Jay! <laughs> Got a blue check. Got it. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Sir. I have a blue check. What up, bro? I got a blue check. I got a blue check. You got it. Gosh, Mika. That's, that's another thing that's kind of dealing with all this man my oldest is uh Jabari's uh, asthma is just it's out of control sometimes oh really yeah man it's like it flares and last night he was perfectly fine yeah. and then, you know but that's the thing about asthma man it just comes anytime yeah man it's hard hardcore man so you got to be ready at any time i got an interview but if you got an interview you got to wait man uh, i mean i don't play about that hey okay what's he doing right now did that, did that help him Was he pulling? Like, was his chest pulling? Yeah, like, you know, like he was, uh, his chest looked like it was expanding. And then, like, it looked like his stomach was going Okay, go ahead and put him on his machine anyway, even though he said he has relief. Uh, put, so, in his... He said he's still having a hard time breathing. It just looks, this, he doesn't look like he's taking as much, uh, drink to breathe. But he said he is... He said his breathing is okay right now. Okay, he still needs to go in that machine, though. Give him, uh, give him, give him... Put one of those tubes. He he can show you how to do it. Uh, put one tube in there in the machine, and then turn his machine on. Tell him to show you how. Just it's just one though. You just only need one valve. All right. I'm on my way to y'all now. Tell him tell him to show you what, what I'm talking about. Put one in there, and then turn the machine on for him. When my babies are not feeling good, bro, like it's not a cool feeling. Bro. You be trying to focus, you know, especially when you're in work mode. You like, okay, I gotta do this, gotta do that, and then something like that happens. You like, all right, all right, okay, you know what I mean? Pause. Oh, the interviews like this and then, you know. Thank God I got a team, yo, uh, that understands. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm a dad first before I'm anything. Like, before I'm an entertainer, comedian, actor, any of that stuff, I am a dad first, and uh, and they understand that about me. So. Um, you know, this thing with my son is, he's been dealing with this asthma for eight years, we've been, <sighs> but he's been kicking asthma's ass, I ain't gonna lie, he's been kicking asthma's ass, but still doesn't make it any less frustrating, you know what I'm saying, it's just like, it's like that damn, it's like that person you think you blocked, and then they keep popping up in your inbox, you're like, god dang it, I thought I blocked you, it's that, that asthma is that person I blocked, like, damn it, guess we got it, cool, doc. See you later. And then that nigga shows right back up. God dang it. Nigga. And he always shows up at the most unopportune time. Man. Yeah. All right. Hi. 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 How are you both? I'm doing great. How are you? Good. Good. Okay. So we are still probably about maybe three and a half minutes away. Um, so I'm going to wait until we get a into a commercial break, and then once we do that, I'll get a mic check from you guys. All right. Okay. Um, a mic check from you guys. Uh, count to 20 out loud. Maybe you alternate, like, odds and evens, just so we can get a mic check from both of you. And then you'll just hang out on the line for about two, two and a half minutes. We're going to play some of the video, and then our anchors will start talking to you, and we'll be live on air. All right. Okay. All right, go start counting. All right. One. Yep. Two, three, four, five. Attention, mom and dad joined us on the phone this morning. Jay and Tanika and Tanika Meyer. Good morning. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Okay, so this is really fun. You give us the story behind this. I love when little kids do stuff like this. So go grab. Uh, I was uh watching the season finale of Empire. And uh, I was confused at how I felt about the ending. 
Uh, and I was like, man, I don't know what's going to happen next season. They did a lot this season. And then I was, I was really like, had this, I guess I had a face of attrition, like confusion. And then my son was looking down like, yeah, like I get it, dad. And he just crawled up on the couch and just started talking. And it, it started from there. Oh, I bet he is. Well, you know your family, guys. We, we sure like talking with you today. Beautiful family. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, he's going to be on stage doing stuff today. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Thank you. All right, you're the same. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Thank you. So, are you guys still there? Yes. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. That was great. All right. Thank you for having us. All right. Have a good day. Good to see you. Bye. Bye. How many of these have you looked at today? Maybe just two. Two? Have you eaten breakfast yet? Hmm? White. Some what? Some fries? That is not breakfast, boy. No. I'll be back. Hey, man. Here's when you know you're going to get in trouble when you just get up out of the bed and you don't make your bed and throw stuff on the floor. Because you can't because the wife ain't here anyway. But she's gonna totally kill me. She sees this on the wall. I'm gonna edit this part out. Um, <laughs> <laughs> she's like, DJ, I'm going to kill you. If I die, she successfully killed me as a nurse. <laughs> she might. Uh, and that's okay, because I die with a blue check. <laughs> oh, someone's calling you. Oh, Jamaica! This is definitely the other area. Hello? Yes. Yes, I'm doing great. How are you? Okay. Okay, let, can I can I do this? I'm I'm run, Can you guys give me a couple of minutes? I'm running behind on a uh, on an interview right now, uh, and I'm I am uh, I'm trying to my Skype. I was doing a Skype interview with another company, and uh, it was shutting down. So I'm in the middle of that. Can I give you guys a call back in the, here in a couple of minutes? Probably like uh, another ten minutes. Uh, ten minutes. Is oh, is it is it a live segment? Is it a live segment? Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I, okay. Let's do it. Okay. All right. I'm going to put you on the wall and then they're going to find you over with the radio, okay? Okay. Okay. Are you getting this struggle? Uh, I'm getting all so, of it. So what's going on? Can you tell me what's going on? Oh, okay. So apparently he got knocked off on the Skype interview and he's on another interview that is supposed to be on a little bit early, but there's kind of a little health scare this morning, but you know, we're good. Um, and, uh... <laughs> Now he's absolutely, absolutely found. I'm him. stalling basically to, to, because I'm supposed to be on this interview right now, but the times ran into each other. So I was supposed to be done with this, being on this interview. Now I haven't even started this one, and I'm on this. It's crazy. Uh, but we found him. Come on in. Yeah. That's what matters. Yeah. She's got to stall. Yeah. <laughs> and technically, this one would have been, but this, the Skype is acting crazy. Pilates and falling backwards on pavement Are the right way. No, I. And it's, only, it's like what? What kind of show am I on? I don't. Hello, how are you? I'm doing great. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> I knew I was on something. 
Cause I ain't graduate. I knew I was smart. Well, I'm gonna stop what we were doing out there. <laughs> that nigga act like I wasn't smart. I knew this. I saw another day they, they, they studying at Harvard. Does that mean I get a rank on honorary? <laughs> <laughs> Doctor, Doctor Pryor. I did this. Doctor DJ Pryor. Does that mean that? <laughs> I told you, I think that'd be a dope episode though. Us going to Harvard. Yeah. Let's do it. Us going to Harvard. That's you gotta wear a lab coat too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Does that mean I got a doctor for that show? And just walk around you saying big words. It was literally we were watching uh we were watching a show called Empire and it was the season finale and I was confused about how I felt about the ending of it. I was like, man, what can they do next? They did so much in this season. How are they gonna bring it back? And I was like, I was sitting there like really perplexed and my son looked up at me and I guess I had it, it was on my face of confusion. And I looked down and I was like, man. And he was like making the face back at me like he understood what I was saying. I said, you get it, man, you understand? He crawls up on the couch and we started to have this conversation together. And uh, that was really how it started. He was like, like, man, like, Dad, I get it. You know what I'm saying? And he was responding back to me. And I was like, really? And so what do you think about it? What's your take on it? And then he starts to give his little opinions. And I was responding to what I felt like he was saying to me based off of his gestures. Not even necessarily what he was saying, but his gestures. And, I, and then we just had fun. I, I've always talked to my kids like they were, you know, responsible and they were older and they understood even when they didn't understand. So when they did, they, they started to communicate early. Even if they couldn't say words, they knew how to communicate in gestures, hands, uh, their facial expressions. I did the same thing with my oldest and he's eight, but when he was Kingston's age, he would do the same thing. He would communicate the same way. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Can you just tell us why you decided to post this video of you and your son? Uh, you know, actually my wife did it, but we recorded it um, because, you know, I was, uh, we were watching the season finale of Empire. And uh, I, was, I was a little perplexed about the ending of it. I didn't know how I felt about it. And I was like, man, this is crazy. I don't know what they're going to do this in the next season because they did so much this season. And then I was like, I was sitting there, I guess I was kind of like this. And my son was like, and he got up on the couch. And I said, you feel me, man? He was like, yeah. And that's how the conversation started. And my wife was like, I was, you know, she's like, I'm going to get the camera. And she grabbed the camera. And we just, and she recorded it. And it just, it was a moment between he and I, which is all the time. It's all the time. But this one was just, he was really excited that he was being heard. And I'm sorry it took so long, guys. My apologies, man. I, it, today's been crazy. I'm sorry about that. No worries at all. Happy early Father's Day. Thank you so much. Alrighty, bye. All right, bye-bye. I was doing uh, Now This. Now, now This, yeah, I was doing them. So I just got done. That's my third interview of the day. The rest were like local uh, uh, news stations and stuff. Like not local, but uh, they're local to their 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 surroundings or whatever. I just did those. So I was just doing press, uh, and I think that's my last one of the day. All right, man. Let's do it. Got you. Yes, sir. Will do. Okay. All right, bro. Uh, we just closed uh, a deal with Denny's. We're doing a Father's Day thing, Kingston and I. So I'm flying out to Miami tomorrow. We just closed the deal. I just agreed to it. So 
we're doing it, man. Uh, this is, you know, one of many things. So, takeoff is real right now. So, guess I gotta get packed. All right, guys. <laughs>